guys, Kingsley here. So we've just done, um, we've just finished this uh, garden room behind me. This is a fully commercial project we've just done for a customer, um, Elsie Boo, who basically do really nice um, high-end homeware. So what they wanted was sort of somewhere where people could come and view their products and have a look around as a sort of like show home kind, kind of thing. So what I'm going to do is just run you through exactly what we've done here and then we're going to have a look what our customer did inside because this one has been finished inside to a really nice high standard. First of all, starting with the actual build. So we've got a six by three meter guard, garden room. Um, in this case, it's a commercial one, as I said. We've done two sides in, in uh, metal cladding. We've done two sides in really, really high quality cedar. So um, this is Western Red uh, Cedar on here, which is like really premium grade. We've got anthracite soft bitten fascias here with brushed, uh, with brushed chrome uh, spotlights coming all the way across to light, to light all the front up. Looks a lot better at night, but it's hard to see now. We've got um, a French door in here, so both of these doors open, which I'll show you in a second, with two side lights with half opening windows. These are 2.1 meter by a meter. We've got one on this side, and we've also got one on this side. So the front is nearly all glass. And again, we've added another window on the side as well. So when I take you inside, you'll see the glass a, a, a bit nicer. On this side then again we've got all the um, western red cedar as the cladding. So coming around to this side there, what we've done, we've used um, it's anthracite grey metal. Um, so it's basically a sheet of metal that is um, that is powder coated for obviously to weatherproof it. So there's totally no maintenance, you don't do anything with this whatsoever. You just, just leave it alone and coming all across the back as well. Uh, so coming across the back here, yeah, we carried the metal on all, all the way through here. We've got a black guttering and a black down pipe which is coming into the chippings. Um, and obviously the, the softened features around the side just like on the front. If I take you around now, I'll show you actually inside so you can see it. Something else we do with these, look, we put all the, we put all the um, caps over all our screws as well in a matching colour to really tidy it all up. So a lot of people are a bit worried about having this sometimes, but I mean, I, I quite like the look against the cedar, it gives it a kind of cool modern look. So we've got French doors here. Yeah, so we've got a real nice big opening to, to allow us to come in. So as I said, we've got Elsie Boo, which is the company that we've just done this for. What we've done in this room exactly, so we've fitted a sort of tobacco-y and um, dark oak laminate flooring. So we put a, 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 a bead in the same colour coming across the, the, across the door. We've plastered the full room, uh, we've painted it white, and we have added this white fixture. So we've got white spotlights, We've got white plug sockets, which are literally all over the place. They're hard to see if there's so much furniture in this room at the moment. There is sockets everywhere. We've got um, white light switches. And then the windows, which I was showing you earlier. Our customer, Deb, she was a little on the, on the petite side, I think in her words, in terms of a lot of people have these windows with so the open height, but she was worried about being able to reach up. So what we did is we turned these windows into half opening windows. So they're, they're nice and easy to reach. There's absolutely loads of airflow in here. Every single window has got a half opener on them. But the doors are open out twice. Both doors, press doors open up, and then we've got the half opening windows on, on here. But since lockdown, obviously people are not going back to work now. Some people have started businesses. So Deb, who owns Elsie Boo, um, need, need, needed some extra space, basically. They, they didn't have enough room in the house, and they wanted a, a really nice sort of sh show, a show home that they could bring customers to, to have a look around all these, these great products that, that they sell. And um, yeah, so obviously with people not going back to work now and things, these rooms are an absolutely amazing addition to the home. In most cases, no plan of mission. We, we can talk you through all that when we have a site meeting. But yeah, no plan of mission, and we can build you an office, a show home, whatever takes your fancy, really. <laughs>